Bonjour les enfants. Now, this morning I went for a walk and I was really amazed because my neighbors, mes voisins, have put a lot of effort and uh, originality in creating des épouvantails or the scarecrow in front of their maison. Alors, in front of their maison, of their house, they have lovely, lovely épouvantails. They are really original and I've taken pictures of them this morning and I've put that on a sheet and I thought as a possible assignment, like you can do it or not, it's up to you, but I think you would have fun doing it, would be for you to describe some of the épouvantails that I have given you, given you. I have given example how to do that for uh, il porte, for when it's a boy épouvantail, or elle porte, when it's a girl épouvantail. And uh, it's up to you to do it. You could create your own épouvantail, your own scarecrow, dress it as you wished, the most foolish way. Perhaps you could do it for real, put it in front of your door and have your own scarecrow outside. That may give you a lot of ID. But for the French assignment, if you could also describe it using the French word, now that would be really good. Now, to help you out, uh, some of you uh, may not know all the words, I'm going to review all the flashcards with the words uh, that we have learned. So for the year three and four, it might be new words, but uh, you can learn them and you can look back at the video to uh, look uh, and see them. I've uh, separated them in uh, masculine, un, and, and feminine, une, so you are, it's easier for you which one is which. I'm going to start with all the masculine, un, un, bleu, the blue ones, okay? All right? Alors, we have here, un chapeau, okay? Un manteau, Un pantalon, un sac à main, un sac à dos, un bodet, un short, un T-shirt, notice that you can write it both ways, just with the T or T-E-E, -E. alors un T-shirt, un pull, no doubt the French people have taken an example from ours, and this is definitely not French, they pick it from English, alors un pull, un blouson, un Jogging, that's going to be useful. Lots of my sca scarecrow wearing that. The basket. The line is red, but it's a mistake. It's masculine. If you had only one basket, well, the S you will not see. It will be like that. A basket if you only have one. The basket if you have two. A maillot de bain. No, I've not seen any scarecrow with that yet. A pyjama. Now, I've not seen anyone with a pyjama, but I saw one with a robe de chambre, which is a, a kind of dressing gown. I'm going to spot it uh, in my uh, file. Des gants, if you have two. If you only have one, it's un gant. Okay, I'll put a S if you have two. Now we get to the baddies. Now, funny enough, with the clothes, the baddies are re related to the bad weather. And one that you may remember, un parapluie. Alors, notice that word finished by E, and yet it is un. Alors, bad weather, un parapluie. And the other one that's linked to bad weather and is also a baddie, un imperméable. Alors, notice it's finished by E, and yet it is masculine, un imperméable. Looking at all our feminine words now, okay? Feminine, red. Alors, une robe is for a girl anyway. Une jupe. Huh? You remember this one? Une jupe. Une chaussette. Now, imagine chaussette, not to mistake it with une chaussure. Alors, a chaussure, you can only have one, but 
the chaussettes, you could put seven of them on top of each other. This is how you remember which one is which. Alors, une chaussette and une chaussure. Uh, this one, everyone remembers. Yes, it is in butte. You know what can do with that? Yes. Mm. Une veste. No? Kind of blazer for girls. Une chemise. This is a normal shirt. And when you wear that in the night, it becomes une chemise de nuit. Alors, nuit is night. Une chemise de nuit, which is the nightgown. Une écharpe. You'll notice that some scarecrow have some. Une casquette. Aha! Mes épouvantails have that as well. Notice. Look for it. Une cravate. Not seen any yet, but it would be easy to put. Une cravate. Des lunettes. Alors, des lunettes, because you have two. Hein? Un, deux. And des lunettes. Glasses. And obviously, if you are for the sun, des lunettes de soleil. Alors, you see many uh, scarecrow of that, des lunettes de soleil, because we have nice sun these days. Alors, voilà. This is going to help you for your little assignment. There are examples in the file. It's for you to do it or not. All right. So this is my suggestion for this week. Au revoir, les enfants.